Okay, so the first super chat for today is from Marina. This is for Tommy Johansson uh, with Halloween. Okay, let me check that one out. I've checked out the other video that he has done. This is Halloween, but he released another video for Halloween. So, and I haven't seen that one. And it's from the band Halloween. I've done a reaction to them. I think it was it last year. I think it was. Or was it the year before that? I don't remember. So Tommy Johansson, Halloween from Halloween. Oh wait, <laughs> does he have a, does he actually have a guitar like this with the LEDs? If so, that's super cool. And I see some skulls on the neck here too, of his guitar. That is cool. A custom guitar for Halloween? What? It seems like a head of Terminator or something like that. Is this his own guitar or is it from somebody else? Is it based on on some kind of concepts? No fate. It's interesting that uh, the, the, the chord progression in Halloween or Halloween themed songs are much different than your average song is written in. The way it sounds creepy and also the way we hear the strings in the background and the melody there is very interesting, uh, definitely. I don't know on the top of my head like what number of chords it is progressively, but it's definitely distinctive. Bit of acquires in the background too. Oh, Michael Myers on his shirt. Cool riff. I don't know the song. We actually see his edit program here on the, in the background. I am not sure if it is... Wait, sorry, let me return a bit so that we hear that whole part on the solo. It looks a bit like Ableton, I think. I mean, I don't know a lot about the band Halloween, but obviously they must have a lot of Halloween themed songs, right? As it's in their name. I assume so. Uh, let me read up on this. Let's see here. He rebuilt that guitar himself. Terminated guitar. Yeah, I, that's what I thought of. His girlfriend helped him, uh, helped with the eyes. 
Oh, that's cool. They probably just like put on some like small LED lights connected to the lower part of the guitar, probably. I don't know. Carvel guitar, he modified. Okay. I'm gonna return a little bit just to get into the same vibes again as before. Here we go. Oh, guys, I realized, sorry, the screen is not on just yet. That should be better. Okay, let's keep going. That's cool. Um, now, I just saw that the song is over 10 minutes long. That's quite long. I think that's the longest one that I've heard from Tommy Johansson so far. I am not sure if we hear two different guitars in the riff that he's playing right now. In this part, we do hear the chords, if they're major or minor as well. And often with power chords, you don't have that because you just have the first note and the fifth uh, and the third note in a chord that decides if it's major or, or minor. We usually don't hear that in, in power chords, but here we do. And it, it adds a cool effect, I think, to it. It's a fast riff to play. I like how the guitar went to the same note as the voice. There. Oh, that was a quick shift to the chest voice, actually, from the... I mean, it was totally chest voice the whole way through, I think. But from that high of a note back to a low note, impressive. Let me continue. Here we go. Ooh, I like this red guitar, this red bass, too. 
Nice bend up there. I love how the screen vibrated on that note. Oh. Damn! Okay, so what we see now is when he goes higher here, he's, he plays two notes in octaves from one, from one another. One with his index finger, I believe, and the other one with his... I think it's pinky finger, but I'm not sure. It could be his ring finger as well. Uh, and he goes higher that this way but he dampens the other strings because otherwise we would not just hear those two notes the other strings in between he dampens so that we only hear those two notes here you hear octaves It's interesting when he plays the bass, it's almost like you hear the hits of the fingers on the strings. And I'm not sure if it's actually accompanied by some by some actual uh, toms on the drum. But it's kind of like you hear him like hitting the strings with his fingers. I like the voices on the sides. It's the first time that I hear him like more this voice a voice acting kind of doing the... I don't know how to call it. It's more like a growly voice that he does right now. It's the first time that I hear that from him. Or is it using a filter? Okay, so I just saw the screen freeze right now. Let's just start it again.
two lines of guitar here. Multiple. It's so sad that I, this deserves more than what I could have given it right now, right? Because of the stupid lag here, I just had to split this up into multiple sections. Uh, I'm sorry, Tommy Johansson, and I'm sorry, Marina, that I had to uh, cut it up like this. Um, but there were amazing sections in this. Uh, we heard different things than what I've heard before from him. This was the longest song that I've heard from Tommy Johansson. Uh, definitely. Uh, 